Hello uh, and welcome, my name is Miss Multiconsole and welcome back to the dark and twisted world of Persona 5. Actually, welcome back to the simulation aspect of Persona 5 because we are now waiting for the change of hearts from Junior Kaneshiro. So we are just going to chill out for uh, probably a few episodes actually, which is going to be quite nice because I'm looking forward to hopefully finding out some more backstory from some of the confidence. So I'm looking forward to that. I think we've got to go to bed. Yes, we've got to go to bed. Does Morgana okay. have anything to say? All we can do now is wait and see what happens. There's no point in getting impatient now. Okay, this is true. So let's go to sleep. Now all we have to do is wait for them to have a change of heart. Tonight you can take it easy. All right, let's go to sleep. Let's do it. Let's go on to the next day. Maybe we will have a school lesson today. I like the school lessons. Oh! That Kaneshiro truly was an evil stain on society. We got some talking to do. Yay! Same with Kamoshida and Matarame too. They hurt and exploited others just to satisfy their desires. Yes, indeed. Still, there were people around them who noticed their terrible deeds, weren't there? I wonder why they turned a blind eye. Why doesn't anyone help? They probably want to. They can't. They're too scared. Maybe they can't. So it's because they don't have the courage. Maybe. I mean, that's the most plausible explanation, right? I don't know. Humans are so weak. Oh, but they're also strong. It depends on how you look at it. Some some aspects of human are quite strong and others are weak. So it depends. I think humans are quite balanced. Humans. Are you a human, Morgana? Hey, do you think I'll really be able to become a human? I don't know. You're freaky. When I touched the treasure, some memories came back. I tried to force myself to forget, but... What, what, what did you remember? I really may not be human. Oh god, bad foreshadowing right here. I'm sure you are, just be confident. Who do you think you're talking to? Oh, sorry. <laughs> I think I'm talking to you. <laughs> now that I think about it, I gotta be human. I am the core of the Phantom Thieves, after all. It's like Morgana goes through these phases of, like, doubting himself. You'll be okay, Morgana. Okay, it looks like we are ranking up with Morgana again. So that's cool. I like how we just automatically rank up with them. So, rank 5 now. Chance to obtain an item when Joker performs a melee attack. Oh, that's quite nice. All right. Okay, rank 5 now. Cool. I like that. Come on. It's not good for you to stay up this late. Let's go to sleep. I was just wondering, if you do a new game plus, is there a new game plus on this? I'm assuming there is. I was wondering, if you do a new game plus, do you actually get to keep your confidence skills, like your actual, you know, the passive skills? Because that would be really cool. I wonder if you do. Okay, we've got to go to sleep now. Oh, it looks like we're going into the velvet room. Yay, it's been a little while since we had a little encounter in the velvet room. Let's see if that dude, Igor, that's his name. I forgot his name for a second. I wonder if he's going to give us some foreshadowing like he usually does. He usually does that. Our master wishes to speak with you. Heed his words. Okay. You've defeated the repulsive fiend of gluttony this time. <laughs> well done. Thank you. I am glad to see you have devoted yourself to your rehabilitation. This guy always freaks me out. You are not worthy of such kind words, inmate. I suggest you treasure them. Do you recall the whispers about that strange man? Which strange man? Do you mean the guy who is exploiting the palaces? The other metaverse user. Even a chicken could remember something that important. <laughs> Don't sound so cocky about it. A chicken. <laughs> At least my memory is better than a chicken's. <laughs> this is about the cases of those people who shut down, is it not? Indeed. 
I speak of another with powers similar to yours. I wonder if this guy, th th that was the first guy who was going on a rehabilitation and then like his rehabilitation went bad and then he went evil. I wonder if he was like kind of doing the same thing we are but then somewhere went corrupt along the road or something. I don't know. If you are to complete your rehabilitation, you may encounter him eventually. So it's a man, since he said him, so it's a guy. Interesting, so it could be a catchy, or it could just be a completely new character, or it could even be Morgana. <laughs> Yet another thing for me to look forward to. I think Igor is getting satisfaction out of this. <laughs> Creepy. I shall grant you an ability befitting of your newfound growth. Consider it a gift. Yeah, yeah. It would be greatly troubling if you were to not strengthen your abilities. Okay, rank up with Igor as well. God, we're getting a lot of rank ups today. We've had one with Morgana and one with Igor now. Increases the XP bonus granted by Arcana Burst. Cool, so I think that's when you fuse personas, right? I think. All right, All right time to go back to our world. Okay. It's time, inmate. Bye, Justine. Bye, Caroline. Your world. I'll bring you some sweeties next time. <laughs> All right, we're going on to Sunday, which means TV shopping day and collecting some juice for some stat boosts. So that's cool. Oh, telephone, text message. What have we got then? Oh, hello. Maybe not. It's me, Makoto. Ringing me. Are you sleeping? Is she in her pajamas? Uh, I'm still asleep. <laughs> I assume it's okay if you're able to make such jokes. I like it. Makoto seems to have a sense of humor because she she's smiling. She she must have liked it slightly. There's something I feel I should let you know. Okay. Kanashiro contacted me. Oh. Kanashiro? Interesting. He said he's calling off our debt. It seems he's disposed of all the photographs as well. Yay! And, um, my sister and her team have taken him into custody. What? It appears they did not want him to disappear, if you know what I mean. His group was called a mafia, after all. I wouldn't put silencing him past them. Does this mean we were successful in changing his heart? We don't know that yet, but should be. It's hard to say for sure yet. I see. What about those psychotic breakdowns that Kanashiro mentioned? I'm not sure. But I assume he was talking about the incidents that have been all over the news lately. It's the work of that other Phantom Thief guy. The guy with, who has the same powers as us, of course. It really may be related to the other person who has been entering palaces. True. That said... All we can do now is wait until Kanashiro's change of heart becomes clear to us. In a way, this other guy going around in a different palace doing, you know, obviously not caring about palace users or whatever and just, you know, giving them mental breakdowns wasn't, it was kind of, it was a surprise because, well, I was kind of thinking it as I was playing that something like that must be happening because, you know, when we when we learn about if we mess up in the palaces, it could call them a mental breakdown. It was obvious that somebody was doing that, but at the same time, it was just like confirmation that that was actually happening. So that's cool to know. I'm interested to find out who this guy is. Thank you. No problem. All right, can we get on with our simu simulation stuff? Our chilling out episode. <laughs> well, we'll have a few, I think, until we until Kanashiro um, admits what he has done. I think you may know this already, but I've been ordered by Principal Kobayawakawa, whatever is called, <laughs> to look for the culprits. Culprits? Yes, the ones responsible for the calling card. I ask that you try not to stand out for a while. By the way, I usually spend my time in the student council room. If there's ever an emergency, feel free to come and find me there. Okay, it's just occurred to me that like we're quite far into the game now and I haven't finished a single confident. How sad is that? <laughs> That's depressing. <laughs> okay, so I've got loads of people asking to hang out with me. My God, this guy is so popular. <laughs> He's got so many people something. trying to hang out with them. Okay, so I'm gonna save it real quick and then we're gonna do something. 
I think first we're going to check out the TV shopping. Hi everyone, it's time to do some shopping. All right, what's today's item? It's an Uji Matcha Flan. The rich flavor melts in your mouth. Oh, I will totally get this. Give it to somebody as a present. It's a limited time offer. I will buy them, but I don't know who it's for, but I will still, I will buy them anyway because I'm sure it will come in handy at some point. So let's just do it. Okay, cool. Right, now we need to go and get some, some juice. So we need to go to... Wait, I wonder. Let's go downstairs. Let's speak. Oh, I want to speak to Morgana. Oh, it's okay. Never mind. All right, let's speak to this male customer. I've heard the Phantom Thieves sent a calling card to the Mafia. What do you think of all of this? It's exciting. I can see why they'd resonate with you. Young people tend to gravitate toward mo romantic ideas. Allow me to impart some advice. Only intellectuals can find success in life. I don't mean the crude excesses of wealth or status. Look at me and see true success personified. My God, he's confident, isn't he? <laughs> he's smug. If you wish to achieve such true success for yourself, then it would be my pleasure to guide you. Well, I'll be going home then. Well, guide me then. Why did you disappear then? <laughs> Rude. Can we do this, by the way? I just wanted to see. I can feel like I can call whenever I want since I'm oh. full of guts. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. Um. I'm sorry, Master. Currently, I'm on break. I can only serve you... Okay, it's only at night. Okay, we'll do it at night and then we'll come back and do that at night for sure. And so now I will go and get a drink, get a smoothie. And then we'll have to figure out something to do during the day. I'm not entirely sure what, but we're going to have to find it out. We're going to have to do something. Okay, so Station Square I need to go to, I believe. And then we can pick up our lottery tickets and our scratch cards and whatnot as well. So I'm not sure if a lottery is done. 6th of the 28th. Okay, so it's like two days. Okay, so let's do Hi. the scratcher. I never win this, but <laughs> let's try anyway. Yeah. Let's scratch away. Whoa. Go, 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 go. It's a oh, miss. It's next, miss, oh, miss. Okay. Miss, 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 miss. Of course. Always misses. Alright, and um, yes, smoothie time. So let's go to get a smoothie. How much money have we got? We've got 20,000, is that it? Oh god, well I might be able to sell some junk items and maybe get a Welcome. bit there as well. So let's buy this, 5,000, one of those as well. Alright, what was um what was the stat for this? Because I didn't even read it. <laughs> I'm not even sure what it was. I just paid for it without even knowing. Okay, what was it? It was knowledge. Right, okay. Well, every right. little bit helps, so that's awesome. Okay, so now I'm going to go to the airsoft shop, and I'm going to see if I can sell my junk items here. Let's go here. Okay. Ah, oh, we've got no junk items. Oh, God, I really Look, wish I didn't again. spend so much on items, on healing items. So I prepared quite a lot for that palace, thinking that I might run out of, you know, um, items and stuff. So that sucks. But never mind. Okay, what day are we on? We're on Sunday. Maybe the drinks machines will reset tomorrow. Oh, they've already reset. Nice. Let's go around. I'm just going to quickly go around and buy all of the items from the drink machines then. Never mind, I think I just missed that vending machine then because I actually can't get any from this one, so strange, strange. I think I'm going to go and do some confident training with the doctor because somebody said that you can get, you can unlock SP items, so you can like buy SP items from her, and I think that would be absolutely amazing to get. So have you had any side effects since then? Have you collapsed? I'd like to check you out just in case. I don't have any patients. Could you come by the clinic? Yep, let's go. I want to find out more about um, Takemi's shady past with her patient that she had where she, I don't know what she did, but. Oh yes, we should get a persona that matches her as well. Have I got one that matches her? Yes, I got death. I think I've got enough. Okay, I think we're all good. Let's do a clinical trial. I made some more refinements to the medicine. Can you come in? Yep, and we get extra XP because of Matador as well. So let's go. Do you want to hang out? Yes, let's well do it. Then. In that case, go to the exam. Huh? So this is the Takemi Medical Clinic of Internal Medicine. I'm glad it's still open. Sorry, I have a child I need to have examined. Oh. Looks like I have a patient with an emergency. Oh my God, somebody's actually come to the clinic. 
This is rare. And? So, why come here? Aren't you under the care of another hospital? I've heard rumours about this place. I'd like for you to examine her. She was diagnosed with bronchitis, but the medicine she was given hasn't been working at all. She has a fever that won't go away and she's losing weight because she's not hungry. A young girl losing weight is definitely not good. You should go to a bigger hospital. I can't provide a thorough examination here. We've been going to a big hospital, a university hospital in East Shinjuku. But all they tell us is that it's persistent bronchitis. <sighs> a university hospital in East Shinjuku? Does she know something here? The doctor there performs exams like he's on an assembly line. I think he's famous or something. Famous doctor, ha. Huh? I'm just a general practitioner out here in the sticks. As you can see, I don't even have any staff. Well, wait, I've heard there's a medicine that can only be acquired here. Please, I'll pay you. Please, at least just examine her. Damn, he's desperate. Uh, hey. Uh, uh, hold on. <coughs> Doctor, my chest really hurts. Oh, poor girl. Doctor Takemi will help. <laughs> I just, like, stuck her right in that. <laughs> she liked that, apparently. <laughs> Doctor. Ah, oh, fine. She is really, like, putting herself down, isn't she? I know she can help that girl. I just know it. I feel it. Mm. Is your vision blurry? How about your throat? Does it hurt? Hmm, no signs of swelling. Are you sure you've told me everything about her symptoms and treatments you've tried so far? Yes, I'm sure. Hmm... Hello? Uhara san is Dr. Schweiwitzer there? Oh my god. There's something I'd like to ask him about a case that was in last month's medical journal. Okay. I see. Guess the ones in the stock will have to do. There's a shelf by the reception desk. Bring the contents of the second drawer into the exam room. Oh, does she know what to do? You'll need to help me administer the medicine. Also, bring the beaker with the red label in the fridge, a towel, wash basin, and measuring spoon. I wonder what she's going to do. <sighs> well, what are you waiting for? Get moving! Looks like I am Takemi's new assistant. <laughs> but thank you so much. I didn't expect her to recover so quickly. Mm. It was a very unique strain of an infectious disease. It can't be detected by conventional exams. Man, Takemi knows what she's doing. I temporarily suppress the symptoms. We'll make adjustments as her condition improves. Okay, that'll be one million yen. Oh god, damn, a, a million yen? Th th that's outrageous. You're completely taking advantage of... I mean, all right, I agreed to pay. You don't take credit cards, do you? I'll go withdraw some cash right now. <gasps> huh? Wait, you're actually going to pay? She was joking. <laughs> By the way, that famous doctor you mentioned earlier, was it medical chief of staff, Oyamada? Yes, are you familiar with him? I knew it. In that case, I'll make this free of charge. Huh? For, for free? <laughs> oh, that was a really, like, creepy laugh. You seem happy. You're so kind. Why free? Let's say, you're so kind. Yay, she liked it. Not really. But there is a certain amount of satisfaction in healing his patient without permission. Oh, she did it to get back way. at this guy. By the way, thanks to your outburst earlier, I'm going to perform a very special exam on you today. Oh no. <laughs> The wet glands going down my character's face. So, is he your assistant? He seems awfully young. Yes, my assistant. Guinea pig. <laughs> He's about to put in a lot of hard work today, aren't you? Oh god, I feel sorry for my character. Feels like my bond is growing deeper. Okay, did we rank up? Did we rank up? Yeah! Woo, nice! 
been a little while since I had any ranks with any side confidence, so that's nice. Okay, right. rank four now. Cool. I'm scared about what she's going to do to my character. <laughs> um, Doctor, can I go back to school now? Not for a while. You need to start eating and regain your strength first. Can you do that for me? Yes. Thank you, Doctor. <sighs> Don't mention it. Oh, she shouldn't be in a little dinky little place like this. She seems to be really good at her job. Your turn. I wonder what kind of response you'll have this time. Maybe you won't even be able to make it home. Why does she seem to get satisfaction out of this? This is creepy. <laughs> I feel like cooperating. Okay, yeah, we increased our guts. That's cool. All right. Staunch with All right. guts now. Bye. Okay, good work today. Okay, home time. Now it's time to deal with another lady because we've got to do the maid now, next. <laughs> so let's fast forward this. It's just some, some gossip stuff. I don't know why that just randomly came up, but okay. All right, we're home. Ah, you're back. Yep, I'm back. Did you miss me? You know, I've been curious. What's Kosei like? Is it filled with guys like Yusuke? I imagine there are a lot of different people there. Now that you mention it, I have one very interesting classmate. She is a female shogi player, and seemingly quite the skilled one at that. Ah, shogi. Shogi is like Japanese chess. I only know because I have watched March of the Lion, which is a shogi anime, which is a really good anime and I really like it. Are you talking about Hifumi Togo? I remember hearing she's a student at Kosei. They say she's the most beautiful shogi player around right now. Dude, that sounds so that sounds too good to be true. Give me some more info. I do not know much about her. She is not the kind of person to let others close close to her. It sounds like she only focuses on her shogi pursuits after all. It says she's a lone genius. That sounds so much like the main character of um much of the lion. However, I have heard she is commonly seen at the church over in Kanda. I wonder if we get to meet this girl. For real? We gotta go. Ryuji's totally into this. You'll probably get struck down by a bolt of lightning if you're going for that ulterior motive. That ain't it. This is for the Phantom Thieves. You liar. <laughs> I mean, Shoki's a kind of battle, right? She's gotta know all sorts of insane strategies and stuff. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> that is quite the stretch. It is. Churches are supposed to be holy. Don't do this, Ryuji. Ugh, you guys are gonna pay for this one day. Multi, you go spy on her for me. Find out if she really is as cute as they say she is. <laughs> oh, let's just ignore that idiot. Anyway, a shogi expert, huh? Striking an enemy with a moment's inspiration, skillfully strategizing toward victory. Those might actually be good tactics to know for our work as the Phantom Thieves. They say she was at the church in Kanda, right? We should check it out when you have the time. See, Morgana wants to go as well. I see, I see what you're doing, Morgana. <laughs> so we got a new place, that's cool. Um, reflect on your past, confess your regrets, uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, cool. So we also have right. this woman to see and the fortune teller woman to see. My God, I got so much to do, it's unreal. Okay, hey. by the way, your phone was vibrating. Make sure you check it. It was? What, what, what? Oh, I got a uh, speech help. Oh, okay. I'd like to request your help with another speech. I've been feeling more courageous with you around. How's your schedule looking today? Okay, maybe we should do Yoshida because I believe that Yoshida only has speeches on certain days of the week from what I have heard. So I think it would be way more beneficial to do Yoshida instead of the maid today. And then we'll definitely do the maid tomorrow. I keep saying I'll do the maid, but I just never got around to it. But I will, I will. Just, we'll just take it slow and steady. Okay, so let's go and do this with Yoshida. Be sure to accept his invitations. <laughs> yes, let's check his bond. What is he? He is the Arcana, the sun. I don't think I have any sun confidence, so I don't actually think that I can get a persona to boost the XP with this guy. So we'll just go and hang out with him anyway. Let's go. Thank you. Please come to the front of Shibuya Station. I'll be waiting. Okay. Let's go. Time to do protests. 
Everyone. That you possess free will does not mean that you can always do as you please. To make your decisions based simply on loss and gain is to act like a heartless machine. The reason so few people care about their fellow man is because so few have the energy to do so. We politicians have fallen short of our goal to change society. We need your support more than ever. That approach isn't going to work. You have to get the voters more excited. You're going to completely lose the hearts and minds of the people. Again, what I'd like to say is... What? Councilman Matsushita... It's been so long since we last spoke. I wanted to stop by to see how you were doing. Ah, so this man in a suit is a high up person. Oh, you have a high schooler volunteering for you, huh? My, times have changed. Ah, it looks like this guy and um, Yoshida, maybe they were working together at some point. Do you know about the Kuramoto children? No. I don't care. I do care. What? Well, what are these options? These options are lame. I don't know. What are the Kiramoto children? Has it mentioned this before? Let's just say yes. <laughs> that was nearly 20 years ago. I'm impressed that you're so interested in politics. I just didn't want to say that I didn't care, so... I was a member of the Kuramoto children as well. Yoshida and I joined the same year. Did he mention this before? Because I can't remember. I made an amazing career change, going from a pro wrestler to a diet member. Well, wow, that's a very different career choice. <laughs> I was elected easily, but I had no idea what I was doing. I realised I wasn't I wasn't elected on my own merits when I failed to be re-elected for a second turn. That was true for the both of us. No. You made a great comeback though. You you're truly an inspiration. As are you, old friend. You're working harder than anyone on the campaign trail. Oh, there's no need for false praise to impress the boy here. Yoshida's well informed about the inner workings of politics, so I'm sure he'll be a great teacher. However, I suggest you only do as he says and not as he does if you want to become a diet member. Okay. Hmm? And what might that mean? I'm guessing he doesn't know. Know what? You really think you can win the election by being completely honest and making good arguments? You've got to secure votes, or else you'll be forever known as no good Torah. Without honesty and good arguments, there can be no political justice. Huh. It's been a while since I've heard one of your grandiose speeches. Wow. Oh, these have totally different views. Starkin, was it? Tell me, what about Yoshida here drew you in? His message, his speaking skills, it's hard to say. Let's say his message. Only one. Oh, I wanted more than one note. Starken, it brings a tear to my eye. <laughs> you address matters quite directly for a young person. It seems you have been taught right. well. I intend to teach him everything I know. That's what we agreed on. Okay, looks like we might rank up. We've had so many rank ups in this episode, it's amazing. We must have had like four or five rank ups. That's pretty impressive. <laughs> we probably won't get any for ages now. Man of the people allows you to ask for large amounts of money during negotiations. Ah, I've had this come up a few times. I've tried to demand more money a few times and I've never, it's never succeeded. Right. So maybe it will now. So that's nice. By the way, how are things between you and old man Kuramoto? Yes. We're still not on speaking terms. Who's this guy? What's going on here? There's something I'd like to get your opinion on, so I'll be in touch. Very well. Oh, that reminds me. You may still distrust me because of what happened with the missing party funds, but I'm not the one who pointed the, thing the finger at you. That's all I'm going to say. Okay, I wonder if we're going to get to the bottom of who actually stole these funds. Why did he have to mention that? Ah, uh, my apologies. That's all for, t for today. Well then, I'll see you again. Good job. Thank you, thank you. That was an interesting 
little scene between Yoshida and that businessman kind of found out a little bit more about his career I'm one I really want to find out like I hope that we get to find out who really stole those funds I hope we do that would be cool good morning good morning Akechi I made it on time I suppose I'm still safe if you're here I can't be late today too god not a morning person don't blame you mm. No, I was up very early, shooting a news show. I have much more work in television because of the Phantom Thieves. I have permission from my school, but it's still tough to do both. Ah, I can't keep complaining. Well, let's both do our best today. Why does he keep approaching us like this, weirdo? <laughs> what is he trying to accomplish, I wonder? Very suspicious, catchy. Suspicious. Oh, we got class today. So sorry. It's so gross and humid, even though it's the end of June. Oh yeah, in Japan, when the rainy season ends, we say that it opens. Why? What? Why? But in English, it's more common to hear people say the rainy season closes. Be careful. Well, that makes more sense. What? <laughs> Japan is so confusing. <laughs> Expressions for the weather are totally different depending on what country you're in. Okay. Now then, Mr. Starkin. Yes. How about you? In English, what does the term cat and dog weather refer to? Horrible weather. A blizzard, a uh, thunder, heavy rain, partially cloudy. God, I should know this, right? Cat and dog ra ra raining. Raining? It's raining cats and dogs. Is it that? Is it raining? Yeah, it's raining. It's because... I don't know why, but we say it's raining cats and dogs, so for some weird reason. <laughs> I would be embarrassed if I didn't know that one. Good. <laughs> That's right, raining cats and dogs. Yay, a question I can actually answer. <laughs> the strongest theory for its origins is that the sound of rain remember resembles that of dogs and cats fighting. I don't really think that's true, but okay. <laughs> I mean, I don't actually think it's true that it sounds like that, but it's obviously true that that's why that it's called that. Some other European languages describe bad weather as dog's weather too. Okay, interesting. So are we gonna get a stat point? Knowledge, perhaps? Okay, cool. Aren't we gonna rank up knowledge soon? I've done loads of knowledge. Additionally, in Norwegian, they say it's raining witches. And in Polish, they say it's raining frogs. Oh my god. <laughs> it's funny how we have so many different things. I didn't even realise. I thought we were just the weird ones who said that. <laughs> just to say heavy rain, as many things fall as there are countries in the world. Mm. Oh yeah, over here, they say that when a cat washes its face, it rains. I clean my face every day because I like being clean and let me tell you, that's a load of bull. <laughs> I like how honest you are Morgana, <laughs> that's quite funny. Alright that was in, I liked that lesson, partly because I actually, I actually knew what they were talking about for once, half the time, I don't even, like it's normally this new knowledge which is actually quite season. nice I suppose. And what a, what a coincidence, it's raining, it's raining cats and dogs. <laughs> anyway guys, I'm going to stop the episode here for today. I hope you enjoyed, thank you for watching, please comment, rate and subscribe and I hope I'll see you next time. Didn't even get to oh. go